It's now the next day, and I've managed to sleep in the staff room. Uh, didn't go home. Managed to fight my way through last night. And uh, as you can tell, there's quite a few dead. There's one straggler there, but, you know, not going to bother with her. Oh no, shit, there's quite a few. So I'm going to take these out, and I think I'm going to try and get to the second floor. Um, it's probably going to be pretty bad. Uh, shit. Right, this is bad. So, unfortunately, them guys have got through the door, so, yeah. I'm just going to show you what the second floor looks like, hopefully without going on the second floor, because I need to work it out. I've got an oven trick in mind, which... As we can tell, oh shit, they're all for fucking hell. Yeah, so the uh, the second floors were a bit dodgy. Um, but I think, look at that, they're just like falling. I think like maybe one of them would have broke the leg. But uh, I just gotta open these shells. So just gotta stop. And um, I'm gonna try and work my way up there at some stage. Just need to take the majority of these out and try and filter them so they do fall down. And I'm definitely gonna try that other trick as well. Should probably result in me getting burnt to death, but you know, it's cool. I just to kill quite a few of them, so I'm just gonna edge up, and I think we've got the same. Oh shit! Alright. So, let's just see. I've right, got severe damage, so I think we're gonna have to run back to base and get some painkillers. Um, just gonna eat some crisps, a bit of comfy in there, and uh, I'm gonna have to run back, get some painkillers, and try and find some rotten food as well to do this oven trick. Uh, I thought it'd work with bandages or some input. I should think it'll definitely work with food. I mean, I could die, it's severe damage, and it's moderate damage. Uh, all right, just being a bit of a hypochondriac at first. And all these are heading north, like, uh, like penguins or seagulls or whatever. But, uh, yeah, just run back to base now. Try and get this shit together. Uh, as you can see, um, quite a few of these have migrated around my base. And this is a bit of a worry, because the base isn't anywhere near finished. There's been no, well, no progression at all from last time. Um, I've been preoccupied with the shopping centre. And um, I just haven't really got any defences or anything. So... Yeah, and it's not finished, so it's proper ropey. Like, I slept in there the other day, and as soon as I came out, there was a zombie right on my door. And I'm really sure that, as you you know, you might have gathered, I'm fairly, uh, fairly lackadaisical and not really that cautious. <laughs> so I'm just going to grab these painkillers and uh, probably have a sleep and uh, head back the next day when I'm 100% better. It's now the next morning, uh, I feel better, my injuries seem to have left me, somehow. Um, so what I'm going to do is just go into this restaurant which is by my base, and head into the kitchen, from what I remember there was a lot of rotten stuff in these fridges. Um, shit. Huh. Huh. <laughs> Maybe there wasn't, so... Right, all the uh, the water's gone off as well, which is uh, which is good to know. And uh, other than that, but there's a zombie, hilarious. So I must have to go next door, I think. Um, I think this was a, a food place. Right, okay, so what I'm gonna do is fill my bag with all this crap, and I think I'm gonna chuck all this in the ovens and just see how far I get. See how much I can cook. Uh, I could do again some, some like ramen dinners or something like that. I'll take them, uh, them rounds as well. Um, lollipop in the bin. In fact, what I'm gonna do? I'm actually gonna do a test in here. Oh shit! Oh no, the electric's gone off. Shit. Uh, well, that is a shame. Um, what I was actually going to do is leave food in the ovens and it sets on fire and burns the building around it. But as you can tell, the uh, the power's all failed, so it's back to run and gun. 
So I'm going to head down there. Ah, there, cry myself to sleep a bit. I really shouldn't have gone out that door. Quick tip. Don't ever go out the same door you came in, especially if you were followed. Look at all these. I'm actually going to have to man up and clear all these up around my base, because I'm going to start building again soon. Uh, really soon, probably tomorrow, actually. And uh, I can't have these just giving me shit while I'm doing it. So I've come back to my favourite place in the entire world. Most peaceful place in uh, West Point. And I've also gone the wrong way as well, I think. I've been down any of this bit yet. Hmm. Don't really want to open any of them doors. Not a narrow corridor anyway. A bit like a... Well, that'd be bad, you can imagine. So I just need to find these stairs again. Really bad with navigation. I seem to lose my uh, direction really quickly. And I also forget that I'm speaking a lot of the times, so as you've, you know, you're probably onto that already. So let's try and go up these escalators without falling. Okay, right, there's one. Alright, cool, so we're on the first floor. Thought there'd be a few more zombies up here than there actually are. But there's a restaurant there. I'm going to check if maybe they run off a different power supply. And there's some thunder and lightning just for drama. Why not just chuck that in there? Right, problem with this, you haven't got as much open floor as I did earlier on. Ah, oh, shit. I'm just going to try and take the mass groups of them out. Oh, I did take some bigger blockers a second ago. But, uh, yeah, this is the, the first floor. Second floor, whichever you want to, you know, count in the, the ground floor is the ground floor. Holy shit. What I'm actually doing, which is a really, really stupid fucking idea, is I'm going around into all the rooms and attracting all the zombies to try and get them out into the open. Just kind of, you know, no surprises kind of mentality. Just going to open these doors as well. And there's definitely some in there. So if we run back, we should have quite an army. I'm just going to have to mash through them. Um, I thought there was an army anyway. Huh. Oh, there we go, there's a few of them. So if I just plough through, uh, plow through a lot of these, and then I can explore the top floor. I think it's the top floor anyway. In peace. Managed to clear out the majority of them, as you can see. Um, there's a bit of a flood there, and I think I found what looks like a food market with some uh, some clothes and shit in there. So I'm just going to take all the canned goods that I can. Uh, the tunas, the beans, the soups. I'm not going to take dog food because I don't need it yet. If it gets to that, then fine. But um, there's a corkscrew there as well. I've not seen wine yet, though, but I might have to come back for that. But uh, as you can see, it's absolutely huge, this place. This is the the next floor up, the first floor. And uh, there could still be some Zeds around, but I'm just going to keep checking them out, see what's what. There's a shitload of, you know, medical stuff there. I'm just looking for a gun shop, to be honest. I was almost certain it was going to be up here, but this seems to be the pharmacy. So that's cool. That's fairly close. Don't have to run back to normal West Point for that. Uh, what's in here? Twine, so this could be a sewing shop, clothes shop kind of thing. Some sheets, stuff like that. So when I come to make tents and everything, could be a camping shop where I could get tent pegs, I'm not too sure. But uh, let's just head on. Um, okay, what have we got through here? There's probably going to be zombies in here, by the way. Um, I seem to have attracted a lot of them out. I dare say I may be beaten them all to some extent. The mass of them seem to have cleared up. I'll probably say that now and just get absolutely gang raped by them all, but you know, a lot of them have gone, as you can tell. Never freely walked around it before, so I'm just gonna eat some uh some chips. That's my guy's fairly hungry. I don't think there's another floor up, I can't see any any stairs or anything. Alright, uh, shit. On the shops that I forgot to clear out. So as you can tell, I'm back on my pistol. And uh, 
run out of ammo quite quickly for that. Okay, alright, just gonna have to open up a box if I've got them. Uh, just gonna have to drag one over, clear that out, and then explore the rest of this floor and see if we can get upstairs any further, maybe onto the roof or whatnot. Unfortunately, I'm onto my last box of 9mm, which is my last box of ammo altogether. I could search the bodies and probably find, uh, you know, stray rounds every now and then, but oh, fucking hell. Uh, I don't know. I think that could be it. Oh, shit. I'm probably going to have to leave, unfortunately. Um, and there's still some coming from downstairs as well. Right, that's me out of ammo. Um, right, what I'm going to do just quickly. I will come back if I do find any more ammo, but... I'm just going to smash my way onto this roof. I'm just going to smash this window as well. Just so they get out. And, uh, yeah, as you can tell, this is the mall. And a uh, pretty brilliant place. Pretty horrendous place at the same time. But now I've got the problem of trying to just ease my way down. Holy shit! Holy fuck, how the fuck I just got out of that, I don't know. But yeah, as you can tell, they kind of struggle to walk up and down escalators, so what I'm going to do is just head back to the base and uh, continue with the base building. Can come back here, as I said, maybe with an axe, but to be honest, you know, I'm never going to get up them stairs again without ammo. It's now a couple of weeks later, and I've been building a lot of stuff. I've uh, been working on the base, so I'm just going to give a quick tour of that. It's nowhere near finished, but three of the towers are coming together uh, to some extent. So, see all these stair sets are going up, and we're kind of getting a bit of interlinking going at the moment. So, we've got this bit. There's chairs in every room, just in case I do need to sleep. Um, I will build tents, a little campsite. So, this bit's running over here as well, and this is where the camp, not the camp, Sorry, the um, the farming is going to be up here. I'm going to have a little farm patch, um, which I'll explain in a second. And, uh, oops, didn't mean to go down there. And this is then linked to here. This is the kind of abstract building. Fuck the stairs up a bit, but that's going to link over this way as well and over here, which are both going to be taller. And everything's going to link together fairly well. So back to the farming. Um, I thought I'd seen a trowel and a spade somewhere, but... I couldn't find them, I thought they were close proximity in the cafe, but they weren't there when I last checked, so I'm going to have to go back to the shopping centre, the mall, whatever you want to call it, and um, I did find some shotgun shells, went back to the cinema before to get some ice cream and some chips, but I'm running out of food, I've got quite a lot of seeds, so I remember there being a hardware store on the bottom floor, but this could be really risky, so I'm going to get my shotgun and the 24 shells that I did find, and head down there and see what damage I can do and hopefully I'll be able to find exactly what I need. Just on my way down and as you can tell there's still a lot of aggro around here um, and not really a lot I could do. I mean I could kind of slowly but surely try and take these out with an axe but my axe would eventually wear down and I'm not happy with doing that while I'm still building because obviously that means I can't chop logs or anything like that so I could use the stealthy approach if I had something to repair my axe with so if I can find some duct tape scotch tape glue wood glue anything like that I can actually repair my weapons and you know that could be an option good thing is about this is I can actually follow the trail it's almost like a, a pathway to the uh, to the wall where I've killed them completely unintentionally but uh, definitely leads here I think and obviously it's east anyway in my base so I'm not going to kill any on the way in I've got a feeling after leaving last time that there could be even more in there um, yeah but hopefully it's going to be a quick in out operation no pun intended there but um, hopefully it hasn't filled up there were a lot on the stairs if you can remember so I'm just going to check all these buildings these seem to have right, let's see these uh, don't really need CDs. A lot of thunder and lightning in the background. Um, 
Seems I only come here when it's stormy. As you can tell, there's a lot of the dead bodies. I think this was a hardware store, was it? A fork spoon. Right, so there's some duct tape. We'll take that for the axe. Um, hmm. Dish towel. Don't know what I can use that for. Hammer. Scotch tape. I'll also take... There's like a percentage that it works on. It's, uh, it's quite hard to explain. So if I take everything, I should be able to repair it fully. Ball on the magazine. Art oh, Rubik's Cube. Awesome. Uh, lamp. Uh, I'm going to take a sheet just for my tent. Um, spoon. Take a battery. Um, I could do with finding a carpentry book as well. But I don't think... There's a bookshop, is there? In here, I can't really remember. Um, I'm just going to take a drink from one of these fountains or fill my water bowl. And we should be good to move on slightly. I think it might have been to the east of the shopping centre. Um, right, let's just keep going. I mean, I'm not going to risk going upstairs. I just need to find this hardware shop. So that was the couch one. Um... I mean, it's a good indicator of where I've been, so... Oh, fuck, I thought there was one alive then. There's still a few outside, so I'm not going to fire off any unnecessary shots. Um, I think this led onto the bookstore. Ah, fuck off. Right, it's not a bookshop anyway. Right, okay. Um... Close that door. Um, I'm going to just head up here and try and do this quickly because, as you can tell, there's quite a bit of aggro down there. So, is this it? What's on these shelves? Magazine. Right, okay, carpentry. Advanced carpentry for beginners. Master carpentry, I'll take. I think I need the expert one though. Master carpentry again. Um, shit, shit, shit. Cooking, fishing. I will do some fishing soon, uh, providing I get my campfires set up and stuff like that. Anything in there? Um, oh, it's relatively pointless at the moment. I'm nowhere near equipped to be thinking about any kind of stuff like that. Can I just walk in? Right, what have we got in here? Candles, cube. Um, the fuck is that? Eat that, whatever the hell it is. Majeska. Wallet. Good God. Uh, toy bear. Could take for the house, but not really interested at the moment. Um, candles. Belt magazine. Wallet. For fuck's sake. Um, shit. I'm sure there was like a gardening or hardware shop. I don't mean like uh, there was no axes or anything like that, but I'm fairly certain it was somewhere. I mean, I know somewhere doesn't, you know, really help, but this looks like a kid's shop, like early learning centre or something. My guy's fucking tired as well, it's the last thing I need. Um, let's check up here. Is that Spiffo's? Ah, oh, nice. It's like a little play area thing, that's pretty cool. I'm not going to bother. Um, I can't get anything from back there, unfortunately. So I'll just check the west side. I don't mean like west side, it's in like I'm being gangster or anything. I actually mean the actual west side. Um, so I'll to remember what stuff was. Alright, what have we got here? I think it's just a clothes shop, is it? Um, let's just check that carpentry book. Uh, level 5. I think I need the one for level 4, which is expert. Hey, I'm sprinting level up. Who's saying bolt? Um, skills. Yeah, so I need I need the expert one. Shit. Uh, what have we got in here? Salon. Razors. Check what's in here. Sometimes you can get shotgun shells on these things. I doubt they'd have them in here. In a barber shop or a salon, but uh, yeah, you can be hopeful. 
Shit. I'm going to try and work my way upstairs again. This could be the end. <laughs> I know, you know, it's a bit risky, but there seems to be a staircase by Spiffos. I'm not going up the escalators because yeah, it's just bad news. That's really pissed me off. I can't work out where that thing was. Okay. What have we got here? Right. I don't know what that noise is. Oh, that's my footsteps. I've never heard them that loud. Oh shit. Fuck. Oh, that was a lucky fucking escape right. What I'm going to do is just go downstairs and not be a complete fucking idiot. Um. Right, that was close. I don't know if I've been bit there, which would be really fucking annoying. Oh shit! Fuck, right. Fuck! Fuck! Come on, run. Right, time to get out. Oh, that was dreadful. Fucking dreadful. I'm gonna go up the west side again. Oh shit, I need to check up a bit. I've been scratched, I don't know if that's gonna affect me. Oh, that was the most stupid decision I've made. See, desperation kicks in and all sorts of shit. So I'm just gonna bandage quickly. I could be zombified. I'm not too sure. I think it might only be bites. But uh, I'm a construction worker, so I've got you know seriously thick skin. And uh, I'm just gonna reload. Take a few of these fuckers out, so they don't follow me back to base. What I generally do. Let's take a few shots and a lot of them will run south uh, to the south of the car park which drags them away from my base because a lot of them on the right there won't actually be able to see me so I'm going to head back to base and possibly be zombified I'm not too sure okay that zombie trick didn't work I do need to find a trowel and a spade um, which could mean maybe even going back to old west point again unfortunately kind of do regret building a base around here I thought there'd be a lot more loot I couldn't find a gun shop but uh, I might have to head there next time get a trial on the spade if I can't find one around here but I don't think I picked it up I'm fairly certain I'd, uh, certain? It's Sean Connery um, fairly certain that I didn't pick any of them up so it's really baffling to where they've gone but I'll have to work it out next time